This is the story of Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Once upon a time, in a cottage in the woods, there lived three bears. There was a great big papa bear, a middle-sized mama bear, and a wee little baby bear. Every morning when the three bears awoke, they ate porridge out of their special bowls. Great big papa bear had a great big bowl. Middle-sized mama bear had a middle-sized bowl. And wee little baby bear had a teeny tiny bowl all to his own. In the afternoon, the three bears took a walk and afterward read in their special chairs. Great big papa bear had a great big chair. Middle sized mama bear had a middle sized chair. And wee little baby bear had a tiny chair all his own. The darkness of night enfolded the three bears and each reflected on their day of wonder. Father bear, mother bear and baby bear got ready to sleep in their own special beds. Great big papa bear slept in a great big bed. Middle-sized mama bear slept in a middle-sized bed. And wee little baby bear slept in a teeny tiny bed all on his own. One morning at breakfast, the three bears sat down to eat their porridge, but it was too hot. Let's take a walk in the woods, said great big papa bear, until it cools down. So away they went. Wait for me! While they were gone, a little girl named Goldilocks came by. She walked out to the window and peeked in. No one was home. She saw the three bowls of porridge sitting on the table. That porridge looks awfully good, she thought, and I'm awfully hungry. So she tiptoed into the cottage. First, she tasted the porridge in the great big bowl. Too hot, she said. Then she tasted the porridge in the middle sized bowl. Too cold, she said. Finally, she tasted the porridge in the teeny tiny bowl. Mmm, mmm, said Goldilocks. Next, Goldilocks decided to sit down for a while. First, she sat in the big chair. Too hard, she said. Then, she sat in the middle sized chair. Too soft, she said. Finally, she sat in the teeny tiny chair. It was neither too hard nor too soft, it was just right. But when she sat down, the little chair broke. She decided to lie down and take a nap. First, she lay on the great big bed. Then she lay on the middle sized bed. Too soft, she said. Finally, she lay on the teeny tiny bed. It was neither too hard nor too soft. It was just right. Goldilocks fell fast asleep. Meanwhile, the three bears came back from their walk. They sat down to eat their breakfast. Somebody has been eating my porridge, said Great Big Papa Bear. Somebody has been eating my porridge too, said middle sized Mama Bear. Somebody has e been eating my porridge and has eaten it all up, said Wee Little Bear. Somebody has been sitting in my chair, said Great Big Papa Bear. 
Somebody has been sitting in my chair too, said middle-sized Mama Bear. Somebody has been sitting in my chair and it has broken it all to pieces, said wee little baby bear. The three little bears ran and looked at their beds. Somebody has been sleeping in my bed, said great big Papa Bear. Somebody has been sleeping in my bed too, said middle-sized Mama Bear. Somebody has been sleeping in my bed and there she is, said the wee little baby bear. Goldilocks woke up and saw the three bears staring down at her. Help! she cried. She jumped out of bed and ran home as fast as she could. 